Today I'm going to teach you how you can get World Edit while having Optifine and Forge. Just follow along. I'm going to keep this as simple as possible. Alright, let's get started. Okay, so first step, what you're going to do, just open up your browser. should be able to work on any browser. Just type in Forge. Um, it should be the first one. You should be able to go here to your download for Minecraft Forge and it should say 1.18.2. You're going to go ahead and click Installer and just wait here. This is going to be the ad page. Do not click on anything. Wait on top of the right here of the page that says please wait one second or 10 seconds. You just click skip when it's done and it should be downloaded. Next, you're going to go ahead and go to Optifine. I'm going to leave these uh, websites and the link in the description below. I'm just doing it to show you how I do how, how it's done. So you go here to Minecraft Optifine 1.18.2. You click download. And once again, add page wait and download. Click download. Easy as that. Now the last one, of course, uh, we're going to go ahead and go to world edit. You can just type it in like that simple world edit mod here. Here we go. And we're going to go to the right of the page here, which is recent files, micro 18. Just hit download again um, and just wait a couple of seconds. It should be downloaded like automatically. Just hit keep. Now that all of these are completely done, you can go to your desktop and drag them on there. All right, so after the download, make sure you have your Minecraft off. You're gonna go ahead and double click on Forge 1.8.2. Go ahead and install client. You hit okay. Since I already have it, I don't wanna, you know, do it again. But once that is done, you can throw it away. You don't need it anymore from your desktop. You're gonna go ahead and open up your Minecraft launcher. Your Minecraft launcher should automatically select your Forge to, you know, hit play. Or you could just select it from and then just hit play. But what you're gonna do now, you should be able to see this new tab here. You're gonna go ahead and click mods. First, what you're gonna do is open the mods folder Hold on, let me see. okay so you have it like that and then basically what you do since you have these your two mods here you just drag them in here you drag them in there and that should be it you should be able to close this now it won't pop up here automatically so what you do unfortunately you have to quit game again you're gonna go ahead and open up the minecraft launcher select the same one forge and pip play make sure you do these steps exactly how i'm doing them because if you do it the slide is different it can cause an issue and you don't want that you know now that we're back you can go ahead and look into your mods you should have them there just like that now i am using this resource pack just in case you're wondering modern arc and for the shaders pack just in case you're wondering i have the kuda shaders now once you enter your own minecraft world in single player you should be able to apply these mods so when you get on your world uh when you type in first you just click uh slash slash one and you get your wand so your tool you're going to use for world edit mod is a wooden axe yes it's always first and second position and you're going to do from corner to corner so here let me show you this is the height um so that's the first position and second position is let's do it right here now you want to make it glass so you basically just do slash slash sets because you're setting and i just put glass oh yeah so here so see that's that's literally a glass however it's not empty in the inside so you might think like what the hell what the hell you need to fix this right i actually changed it to the quartz uh for the sake of this video so you can see what i'm doing you want to empty the inside it's super easy you just select the middle bottom portion you right click uh, for the bottom and just do set zero because that's not a block and here just close that and close that now when you can make like a little door and as you can see the inside is completely empty now if you want to do undo a command or redo it you just type in undo super simple just like that and there's also other commands that you can use for world edit um however for that if you like this video, maybe I'll make another video about that. But right now, I, I am not going to show you. Also, subscribe to this channel. I know I don't make a lot of videos. But when I do, I try to keep them as simple as possible. And yeah, definitely subscribe. So that will help me out. And if you have friends that also want to do this, but you kind of don't have patience to explain it to them, go ahead and share them this video. All right, guys. Bye.